and we're back to Inkscape 1.4 updates. We can now draw guides using the pen tool. So let me create a straight line, it's selected, I activate the pen tool and then I use my short key RG and then I have this guide. But be careful, I have set the short key like this, so yours might not be all G. I'm going to show you how that can be set. But first you can also create multiple lines and use the same method. This doesn't work on curve segments, so down here you can see we have a curve segment. So you can select that, activate the pencil and then try all G. It's not going to give you a guide. So now let me show you where you can set the short key. First up I go to edit, delete all guides and edit preferences. In the dialog window we want to open the interface and then go to keyboard. This is where the short keys are stored. And here you can see under tools, pen segments, to guides, all G. Because I've set it like this, yours might be empty. Let me reset it. So this is what it should look like by default. Double click on it, new accelerator is shown and then press all G. It gives you a warning message. You may have pressed only G. Let me do it again. And now it works. So all G is set. And by the way, all G is an empty short key. So let me reset it again. And I search for all G. This shouldn't give you any results by default. So you can easily use that as your new short key for this pen segment, this line segment to guide effect. Once again, double click when it says new accelerator, you can press Alt G and after a second or two it should be set. So let me show you again, left click with the pen tool. Make sure it is selected, activate the pen tool and then use your short key. By the way, it is still editable, so we can drag this around with the selection tool, double click on it to open the guideline menu and change, for example, the angle, so it gives you a regular guide. And this is how you can now draw guides using the pen tool. I hope this video was helpful, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.